Well, greetings from the sales floor of Ellingson Motor Cars here in Rogers, Minnesota, northern suburb of Minneapolis, Minnesota. Today we're going to talk about a car that 1955 was the top of the line for a Cadillac, and I'll give you all the details in a moment. <laughs> Greetings and salutations from Ellingson Motor Cars here in Rogers, Minnesota, northern suburb of Minneapolis, Minnesota. Today we're going to talk about our latest acquisition and I'll tell you what, if you had this car in 1955, you were pretty special. Guess what? If you have the car today, you're pretty special as well. Yes, we have a 1955 Cadillac Eldorado Baritz convertible. Talk about a special car. Boy, you're going to want to watch this video from start to finish because we do a cold start, a walk around, and all the extra details that you want to look at on this really remarkable automobile. Now, you can also click on the link in the description and it'll take you right to our website, give you all the pricing of the car, more information, and all that stuff right at your fingertips, and also give you access to all of our cars that are available at Ellingson Motor Cars, and that is over a hundred right now, and everything from the 1920s to the 1970s and 80s and beyond. So if there's a classic car you happen to be looking for, Odds are Ellingson Motor Cars might have it sitting on our sales floor. So remember our website being www.ellingsonmotorcars.com. So let's get into the real details. 1955, this now would be the third year for the uh, El Dorados that Cadillac came up with. And I'll tell you what, 55 was kind of one of their banner years. Lots of uh, improvements, a lot of changes, a lot of really neat features on these cars. Of course, now this has the 331 V8. Now, remember in the old days, one carburetor was just fine. Two is even better. Well, this actually has the two carburetor set up. They were looking at performance and horsepower as well. It was kind of a subtle race compared to some of the other brands out there. But Cadillac was really starting to get some more, more performance oriented cars. You needed a little bit of horsepower to run this, you know, almost 5,000 pound car down the road. Just 1955, I just love the chrome work and the changes that they did in the front that has, of course, the Dagmars. Now, you're going to have to look that up. Look up Dagmars on, on Google, give you the information where those came from, but those are the big bullet bumper guardettes, if you will, on the front of many cars out of the 50s. And this one has by far some of the biggest ones that you could ever have. Again, I love the hood ornaments. It's kind of an art deco, looks like something's moving fast. Everything was orientated towards airplanes and jets and rockets and all that stuff, and Cadillac was gonna be no exception to that rule. But the El Dorado really was one of those, uh, you know, the high end, the luxury car that it was meant to be. And it really kind of had all the options and stuff that you really wanted if you wanted that luxury automobile. Uh, I love the fact that it's got these Saber wheels. That was an option, of course, with the wide white walls and whatever. But the Saber wheels were a special upgrade. Uh, there weren't very many extra upgrades to do on an El Dorado simply because they came with many of the options. You've got power steering, you've got power brakes, you've got uh, power seat, you've got power windows, you've got, you know, all those sort of things. And of course, it's a hydromatic automatic transmission. Anybody can jump in this car, drive it down the road, and go wherever you want to go. Now, I'm looking at these tires. They are really, that is just really a special look to this car with that extra wide white wall. Well, let's take a look at the inside. Not only is this, uh, you know, like I said, the outside being the uh, beautiful original silver metallic type color that it was, that's the original color for this car. But look at that luxury interior, black leather, just really done well, padded dash, of course. Uh, you know, all that kind of stuff is just really chrome steering column and all that stuff, black carpet, nicely, nicely done on the inside. And again, being as a Cadillac, you're gonna have a power top your mere hit of a button and boom, zip, the top will go up. No problems in case you get in the rain. It also does have the parade boot, which is a, was another one of those options. A parade boot made it possible for you to, you know, take the kings or queens, princesses or whatever in parades, and they can safely sit on, on the back of the car when you're driving it, and that way they won't have any damage done to the uh, top mechanism. 
Uh, no, it's just beautiful interior on this car all the way around. I just really think Cadillac really had some uh, great foresight, lots of interesting stuff at this time. This is really neat. The gold trim on this. I mean, that is just really uh, something that, you know, this car stood out and it's got the big, uh, the chrome pieces down the side. And it's also in 50, 55. They kind of were a little bit ahead of the game with the, they didn't have the roundy type uh, rear uh, fins. They had more of the pointy ones on the, on the El Dorado, which again is, makes this car really, really special. Just don't see many of these. Um, yeah, it's just something that you just really, if you're looking to add something to your collection, maybe you're a Cadillac guy, want your very first old car, Man, this thing has really got some nice features and very nice car going down the road. Now you can find all of our stuff on Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, TikTok as well. You know, give us a like, leave us a comment or subscribe. We appreciate it very much. You'll find all the information on this car, our current inventory, and as a kind of an added bonus, you'll actually get all some of the cars that we have sold over the last several years as well. So if you got time to peruse the internet, looking to find out about old cars, see what's been out there, what's sold, whatever. Those are some neat sites. If you got the time, by all means, check them out. No, this is one of those cars that's just got lots of legroom comfort. I even do see that they have seat belts that they have put in the car, which generally wasn't something that came in 1955, but on this particular car, someone obviously wanted to take it down the road and drive it as well. Very, very nice. Now, if you're like me, you're gonna say, you know, I love your video, the startup's great, uh, pictures are wonderful, but I gotta come down and look at it in person. Well, we're more than happy to have you come down to Ellingson's. We are open Monday through Friday from 10 until five and Saturdays 10 to four as well. So if you wanna come and look at it in person, we welcome you with open arms. Now, if you have questions about anything that you have, you can give me a call as well at 763-428 7337 and I'll do my very best to answer any and all questions you may have on this car or any of our other inventory at this time. We can help you find you say hey I love your car but I live in uh, California how do I get the car to me? Well we can also assist getting shipping any place in the US. It's kind of a complicated world to get that done but we have had lots of experience doing it so we can certainly be uh, of assistance there. You can say, you know, I went to my local bank, they have no idea I'd like to get an old car alone on a collector car. We have several sources we can direct you to as well, and those people are more familiar with what the old cars are. A lot of banks, if it's 10 years or older, they don't want nothing to do with it, but some of the folks we have, they understand the old car market. No, it's one of those cars, a Cadillac Eldorado, there's not a whole lot of these out there, uh, just a really, really low production car. Nice features, again, if it was your first collector car, boy, would that be nice to have all those upgrades. You know, most of us don't get all that stuff, but Cadillac, being the luxury car that it was, really stands out ahead of the class in 1955. So, with that being said, I thank you again for watching our videos, and, you know, give us a call anytime. Visit our website at ellingsonmotorcars.com. I'm here to serve, and we're that all-inclusive shop to answer any and all questions you have. Thank you for watching our video and we will see you next time at ellingsonmotorcars.com.